Listen, are you tired of traditional heroic stories where good triumphs over evil and white males save the day? Do you crave a refreshing change with strong female leads who rescue themselves without needing a man to help them out? then congratulations, because it seems like you've been living under a rock, because not only have you missed out on most movies, TV shows, and video games in recent years, but you are the perfect audience for Damsel, a Netflix fantasy debacle starring the poster child for shallow subversion, Millie Bobby Brown. Upon glimpsing the promotional materials adorned with Brown, awkwardly brandishing a sword and the cringe-inducing tagline, this is not a fairy tale, one could be forgiven for mistaking it as a parody concocted by some Twitter wag. Yet to our collective dismay, Damsel exists as an earnest endeavor crafted by supposedly rational adults who somehow thought it a good idea to commit such drivel to film. With an ensemble cast, including the likes of Ray Winston and Angela Bassett, one might expect a modicum of quality, but alas, such hopes are swiftly dashed upon viewing. Picture yourself thrust into the generic medieval realm of Damsel, where the narrative landscape is as barren as the desolate wastelands depicted on screen. Here we encounter Elodie, a cookie-cutter strong female lead who embarks on a quest to defy conventions and slay the proverbial dragon. In this world, subtlety is a foreign concept, as every thematic element is hammered home with the finesse of a sledgehammer to a delicate glass figurine. The plot, if one can even call it that, lumbers along like a wounded beast, devoid of coherence or meaningful progression. We're treated to the spectacle of Elodie's plight as she navigates a world burdened by the oppressive weight of patriarchal expectations. Yet, instead of offering nuanced commentary or genuine insight, Damso opts for the path of least resistance, resorting to tired cliches and uninspired plot twists. As Elodie embarks on her journey of self-discovery, we're subjected to a barrage of heavy-handed messaging as subtle as a neon sign emblazoned with feminist slogans. The film's attempts at subversion fall flat as it clumsily parades its agenda without regard for narrative cohesion or audience engagement. And let's not overlook the abysmal treatment of its supporting cast, who are relegated to mere caricatures in service of the film's misguided agenda. From the hapless male counterparts to the token strong female characters. Each role feels like a hollow shell, devoid of depth or complexity. In the grand scheme of cinematic endeavors, Damsel's missteps serve as a stark reminder of the importance of preserving the integrity of storytelling, lest we succumb to the allure of hollow spectacle and empty rhetoric. So if you hold dear the sanctity of the cinematic experience, heed this warning and steer clear of Damsel's treacherous path. And as we bid farewell to this cinematic train wreck, uh, let us do so with the hope that future endeavors will learn from its egregious errors and strive to elevate the art of storytelling to its rightful place of prominence. Thank you for tuning in, everyone. Until next time, stay chic, stay tech savvy, and most importantly, stay tuned for more exciting content here on Chick Tech Spotlight. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more content coming your way real soon.